My name is Brett Wills. I'm a senior sustainability coach with High Performance Solutions. Uh, also, I'm the facilitator of the four Partners in Project Green Sustainability Consortiums. These sustainability consortiums started approximately two years ago when, um, when uh, some forward-thinking uh, individuals and organizations really got together and decided that they needed to converge and collaborate around sustainability. All the consortiums are, are run by um, Partners of Project Green, High Performance Solutions, but is really owned by the member companies. So they drive the vision, they drive the agendas. It's a, a group of like-minded companies who come together to share best practices, uh, leverage learning, training, and um, resources to accelerate their journey towards sustainability. The Hospitality Consortium is known as VAES, Venues Aligned for Sustainability Excellence, and the focus of this consortium is really to drive sustainability throughout their organization, uh, but to also put uh, the GTA on a map as a sustainable destination of choice for uh, folks seeking uh, world-class sustainable hospitality. The Manufacturing Consortium was the second of the uh, sustainability consortiums to, to get started, and it's known as the SMP, or Sustainable Manufacturing Partnership, and the focus of this consortium is in trying to drive sustainability throughout uh, their own organizations. The office consortium known as the Posse or Properties and Offices for Sustainable Innovation and their focus is really on driving innovation around sustainability in the properties and, and offices sector, so the built environment. The logistics uh, consortium, their focus is really on um, identifying and developing innovative sustainable solutions that can be applied in the logistics sector. We really talk strategy about um what each business undertakes from a business perspective on sustainability, um, how we drive the bottom line, how we engage our, our employees, how we engage our senior executives to get them to come on board. Every organization is working to reduce their operational costs and, and the link between uh, energy and carbon and cost is a very, very clear one. You get to step out of your day-to-day -day work. Um, you get to actually sit down and have conversations with people in the same industry who are looking and focusing on the same goals and tasks. The sustainability uh, question is rather complex. Uh, there are lots of solutions out there for different applications and, uh, and different situations. To get um, confidence to know that your challenges are, are probably shared against the masses and it's not just a, an isolated um, issue. And the advice to be given is to learn as much as you can about how other people are, uh, are tackling their opportunities or, and their issues and what solutions are coming up and which ones can you adopt. The member companies learn from each other best practices. They take that back to their organization and uh, implement it within their facilities and within their operations, uh, improve on it and then bring it back to the table so that uh, other members can uh, benefit from the improvements that were made. Consortium group has been, you know, really helpful because everybody has waste and everybody has to deal with it and everybody is dealing in it in different ways and has great ideas to share. There's going to be a lot of projects that are easy and cheap to do at first and they'll get a lot of payback and buy-in from the, the owners if, if, if they're needing convincing because um, they're going to want to see results and, and cost savings. Being green doesn't have to cost you green. You can't do it on your own, at least initially, and maybe never. The value of collaborating is, is, is immense on many different levels. I mean, you, not only do you gain the information, but you, uh, you get to talk to other people who are doing the same thing and running into the same problems and barriers that you are. A bit of advice would be to uh, get involved. Um, there are a lot of organizations out there already doing great things. Um, you know, find out where these associations are, um, become members. Uh, there is a cost involved, but at the end, uh, you have to be able to measure how you can move the sustainability um, forward with, within your organization. For companies who are interested in uh, potentially learning more about a consortium, um, there is sort of a, a initial screening process that an organization has to go through. Um, you can simply request to attend a future meeting and um, you'll be initially screened um, by someone from Partners in Project Green or High Performance Solutions and uh, invited to uh, attend one of the future meetings um, where the members will ultimately decide whether you'll be a good fit uh, for the group or not. Uh, but we certainly welcome uh, organizations who are are really looking to drive their sustainability agenda forward and uh, you know be become a member of this group so